Hey Tubes, Blazer Project. Well, just got home, startup mowers, generator, basically, nice day, got things going and done, and so forth, and I finally give you an explanation of where I've been the past two months. Well, every single weekend of each of those two months, literally was a polar vortex, so it sucked. Plus, also, work is having its own issues. We may be facing a shutdown. Who knows? Excuse me. It depends if they can get things fixed. I don't want to go into detail, and I can't go into detail because of some of the um, restrictions that are placed on, upon us as far as the way things are. So, let's head outside. I'll run you down through everything because there's a lot. And I mean a lot. Gidget's up on her stoop. Now, blazer, nothing's changed on it, but let's poke inside. Oh, hey, Tux. Yeah, I got three cats that have taken refuge inside. I'm not going to complain. They've kept the mice down. And the wind is howling, so watch it. The grommet's busted on that. I've just left it because it gives a chance for the air to actually escape. But this year, plan is axle, shocks, the whole drivetrain comes out, all the freaking brake lines, all of it comes apart, gets ripped apart, and everything. Then the bodywork goes to full power. We gotta get the mud boxes off, both sides, get those removed, repair, and fix all the rust. But also, I've got cleanup to do first. Over here is where the parts washer I want to go, but you can see it's a full on mess. I've got, I've got work to do. Plus, also got to get these tires back out, out to the property. Not back out, out to the property. Because they're from my mom's truck, the Blazer, and a scrap run from last year. More wise, the Dayton is going to get worked on. Painted. I'm thinking a Ford Blue will be a nice color. It's going to get four new tires. Just bring it up to par and make it to where it can work. Workhorse. It's done now. It's a work and play toy. I'm going to be out with it more often. The Husky fired it up just fine. Now, toolbox. This is going to be a conundrum. This year, I'm going to be spending some money and getting four new shocks. All the bushings and everything get replaced. Suspension-wise, just to bring this truck back to life. And I'm not going with some factory items. I'm going to definitely be getting... I'm looking at some Ranchero shocks. And so forth. Get the weight out of the bed. Just start bringing this truck back to life. Repair the paint. That's going to be on a week off I take from work. Is hoods coming off. And some of the other major rust areas on the body are going to get touched up and painted the back seats coming out and it's just gonna be gone through and taken care of plus also I got to fix the four-wheel drive oh back seat speaking of which open this up for you guys I have in here power inverter another solar panel kit another battery and this goes in my shed to give me some more room. That's going to be happening as well. Gutting and cleaning my shed. Getting it reorganized. And just making it to where I can walk in the damn thing. I'm not having to borrow my dad's tools all the damn time. So. 
Jeez, Fart Can City. All of the parts are still covered. The new parts are still over there. All that's good. And so forth. Now, as far as these past two months, it is what it is. I mean, the weather is the main factor on a lot of my projects because I'm outside all the time. So, it sucks. But also, there's a new addition to the family, and there's the little freaking rascal. Hey, Christmas! Hey, you wanna come say hi? This is Christmas. Found him in December, and he is a cuddler. Someone dumped him at the property. And I mean, he was already housebroken and everything. And he was just the little guy that Salem needed. Hey, he's in play mode. But he's the little guy that Salem needed. So Smudge could finally have a break. And speaking, hey, little rascal, move. Here's Salem. Come here. And that over there is Smudge. Say hi to the camera, little cat. She's the oldest of the three. And they know what time it is as far as food is concerned, but it ain't 5 o'clock yet. Now, with it becoming longer afternoons, I'm going to actually be able to get out and do things. So, and I hope they get red, make it permanent because for me, that's a lifesaver. I love being outside for the long afternoons. It means I can get work done, get caught up on things, and actually enjoy life. I am not a morning person at all. So, if they have their way, I'll be more than happy. That's my opinion because I love being outside and it's actually in the sun when it's warm daylight and everything which I prefer which means I can actually put videos out year round hey little rascal sorry Christmas swept my hand no I'm not playing I'm trying to finish the video so other than the cat interrupting that's the whole gist of what has gone on consider it an update video a long one but other than that I'll talk to you guys all later and we'll see what happens this year because I am going to be busy as hell and I'm going to take you guys along for the ride. So I'll talk to you guys all later. Peace out for now. Like, subscribe, comment. Oh, and I am looking at either getting a Twitter or Instagram. Probably Instagram, but we'll see. I haven't looked into a great deal, but I'll get you guys all later. Peace out.